think that locking your car door is enough to stop thieves, but deputies say that's not true. If they see something they like, they're going to do whatever it takes, even smash your windows to get in there. So in Collier County, there were 30 car break-ins in April, some with smashed windows. That's one per day. Wait News reporter Michelle Alvarez joins us live. And Michelle, I understand the Collier County Sheriff's Office is taking this a step further. Yeah, Lois, by hitting the pavement and reminding people of three things. Make sure to watch out when you go to the gym or park, hide your valuables, and lock your car. The Collier County Sheriff's Office said there were 30 vehicle burglaries in April, and thieves are focusing largely on gym parking lots and area parks. I mean, it takes like five seconds to smash the window out, and they do it so quick and effective. Unfortunately, people do see things, and uh, they will try to get in there and take them, so just make sure you always kind of have things hidden and stashed away so no one can take it. I got to tag along with Collier County Sheriff's deputies as they work to remind people to not leave expensive things in plain sight. We're just reminding people just to lock their vehicles and keep their valuables out of plain sight. It's very important that they have to lock their doors, whether it be their residences or their vehicles. Now, when they're in their vehicle, we want them to make sure that they're not leaving any valuables in plain sight. Lieutenant Tom Orr said thieves are targeting unlocked and locked vehicles, and they're even smashing windows if they see a purse, wallet, or electronic device. I always keep them with me, um, and then, uh, you know, anything inside my car, I obviously kind of keep it out of plain view either put it in the front of my trunk or kind of keep it hidden somewhere in the car. I met Claudia Pergolisi at the Dunkin Donuts near Naples Park where deputies were handing out these cards with three easy steps. Especially, you know, driving a nice car too, you always want to make sure that nothing's kind of in plain sight. And with your convertible top, got to close that too. Absolutely. All right, just keep up with these common safety practices just to make sure that they're not victims. Unfortunately, even though we do live in a beautiful place, people do come and take advantage of those. And if your car is broken into, make sure you report it to law enforcement, even if nothing significant is taken. The more information they have, the more likely it is that they'll find whoever is responsible. I'm reporting live, Michelle Alvarez, Wink News.